Hello again, everybody. I'm coming to you with uh, another Brick Stackers Breakdown, and this is the new segment I'm going to do uh, where I look at sets and uh, explain the value and the parts in the set. And what I want to look at today is I'm about to part out this set. This is set 850487. 850487. This is a Monster Fighters accessory pack. I bought it at Lego Shop at Home uh, for around 1048, I believe it was, or 1098. It was somewhere around that range. Uh, and I want to part it out. And if we'll look real quick before we get started, let's look at our part out value on Bricklink. Uh, you can see that the part out value for the last six months the average is 2308, but current sales is 3016. So I've got helpers in here trying to get on camera, and I'm trying to keep them off camera for right now. But anyway, so here's something in the background that's my two boys. Um, so, part of A is pretty good. I can double my money at the very least if I do everything right. So, not bad. So, I'm going to part these out. Let's go back to Brick Store and let's look at what we've got. Now, I have sorted our pieces by highest to lowest, and you can see I've kind of adjusted a couple of the minifigs. This minifig actually parted out at $10 and something for average, but I wanted to drop him down because uh, even though that is the average, he's selling around $8 and some change. So, I'm going to brought him down to 8 I'm probably going to leave the other two alone. This glow-in-the-dark ghost, uh, it's pretty cool. It's 343, and they're selling pretty good. But anyway, if you look at that, he's only available in two sets. The Witch is only available in two sets, which is a collectible minifig, and in this one, and then this zombie right here with a reddish-brown suit is only available in one set. Anyway, let's go on down. Here's your most expensive piece that's not a minifig. Uh, this piece right here, it is actually the centerpiece of the tomb stone the heads the head tombstone in the set uh, I don't know if you can see it real well on my camera over here but this is a dark bluish gray tile and it's uh, got a bat and cursive writing on it and I don't even know what it says it looks like it says rest in peace RIP okay so this is only available in this one set this is your unique item for this set it's 93 cents a uh, very cool little tile printed tile so that's your most expensive piece the chains that go on the ghost if you were to sell the ghost like on eBay uh, this is the one accessory you would include with the ghost it, it attaches to the hands of the ghost and it makes it look like the chain as you can see in this one that I haven't brought it out yet you see how the chains are on there and there's a picture of it glowing in the dark so very sharp little minifig and this is a good accessory and it parts out at 93 uh, excuse me at 47 cents but it's available in a lot of sets as you can see on the screen all right Next down, I guess would be the plant leaves, 6x5, 34 cents. Uh, a briefcase right here, which is cool, a little accessory. Uh, if this thing, this thing open up. It opens up. I didn't know that. Look at that. A little uh, minifig um, briefcase opens up. It's 25 cents. Okay. I'm parting out two of these sets. You only get one of these in each set, even though my screen says two. I want you to know that I'm parting out two. Frog, I've got the frog and a couple of the games that I've broken down, but anyway, they're 24 cents. Uh, you get a rat, <clears throat> and you get a bat, and they're the same price each, basically, 19 cents each. So here's your rat, pretty cool, and here's a bat. Pretty cool if you're setting up a little uh, city somewhere and you want to put these. It's, uh, little accessories and then going on down I'm not going down anything below 19 cents there's a couple more things but uh, everything else is pretty much common uh, throughout the whole rest of the set so most of your money is being made on your minifigs in this set and uh, the accessories are not bad the minifig accessories so that's it for this uh, breakdown uh, I think it's a decent set to break down uh, you know at least double your money I like to get them around triple your money but anyway uh, I'm trying this out of something new. I hope y'all like it. Please, in the comments below, let me know what you think. Um, inspired by good old Clutch over at Bricks on the Dollar. I'm not living up to his uh, quality, probably, but I want to get there one day. So, shout out to him. He does a great job with his breakdown. So, I'm going to name this segment our Brick Stackers Breakdown. Uh, this will be number two. Uh, let me know what you think. And again, follow me on Twitter. Check out my Brick, uh, my Instagram and my Facebook pages, and check out my BrickLink store. And until next time, guys, y'all continue to stack those bricks. See ya.